All right, welcome back to Eyes Open Media. All right, so we are within about 15 days left in the fall season, right? So I was thinking because I when I did talk to um, one of my prophet friends um, months ago, and we were trying to figure out. Remember when I did the distraction video? Well, I was trying to figure out, on, and I was talking to her on Facebook message, and she said something to me on Facebook message on my Currency 365 Facebook message. She said that uh, they, the distraction will probably be when there's a war and God's going to shine his light uh, in that war in the Middle East and revalue that currency. And that's how it's going to be a shocker to the world, right? We all get that already, right? So today I was looking and I was like, and I text one of my other prophet friends and I told her, I said, isn't that interesting that Hanukkah or Chanukkah or however you guys say it, because, uh, you know, it can be C-H-A-N-U-K-A-H or uh, Hanukkah, you know, H-A-N-U-K-K-A-H. I, I have no clue. <laughs> So, you know, but anyways, uh, I'm just going to say Hanukkah because that's the one we all really know. Chanaka is the same thing, but, you know, whatever. <laughs> uh, God bless you, everybody. Whatever you say it, you know, however you say it. But anyways, um, it starts uh, today, actually, this evening, all right, this evening into tomorrow. So uh, Chanaka begins um, December 6th. Uh, nighttime into December 7th and it doesn't end until December 14th end time into December 15th morning okay so I mean <laughs> I mean you can't even make this up <laughs> so you know as we count in on the fall the Lord said that he will shine his light into the distraction which is the Middle East bombings and Syria and Russia and Turkey and Iraq and all these people bombing each uh, trying to destroy ISIS and Daesh he will shine his light and revalue that currency so but what is what is Hanukkah cuz it begins tonight Hanukkah is the festival of light <laughs> I mean, you can't. I mean, seriously. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna do a Frank Twenty Six real quick. Come on, man. <laughs> seriously. <laughs> oh man, that is awesome. I just thought about it this morning. I text one of my proper friends, and I asked her. I said, "Isn't that interesting? The Lord was talking about He's gonna shine His light in the middle of the distraction." And revalue that currency and it would shock the world. And then I told her, Hanukkah or Chanukkah is between now, tonight, and, you know, the 14th into the 15th. And it is the festival of light. And between now and the 15th is when we are expecting this revaluation. Ain't that something? Of course, it can go to the 21st, but this, between now and the 15th is a very, very great chance, especially with the operational rate coming uh, on the 11th and being affected on the 15th, having the tariffs and the taxes uh, implemented on the 15th. However, the lower denoms are expected to be out by the 16th and all types of other things that are going in place. The the salaries of the employees have started. And they got their huge reduction. They need a, they need uh, purchasing power immediately uh, so they can pay their bills uh, and, and their rent and stuff like that and to be able to eat and stuff. So, I mean, so much is going on right now. They, uh, they're, they're, they're asking to stop the currency auction. They, uh, the currency auctions are now at 1182, which is in, should be in compliance with 2% uh, IMF. Um, so, man, it, it was it was striking to me that I was able to, you know, have the discernment to even figure that out. Because I said, wait a minute. The Festival of Light, that's, that's Hanukkah or Chanukkah. And that begins tonight. And it's in the same time frame as when the Lord... Uh, you know, in the fall season, when the Lord said, when the distraction starts to get heavy, he will shine his light and revalue that currency. And it would shock the world because the world thinks that they're in war in the Middle East. So how could that currency revalue in a time like this? 
And I was like, man, did the Lord mean that he was going that he was going to shine his light on the Hanukkah season? <laughs> so here we go. I, you know, I could be wrong, but it makes so much perfect sense. <laughs> It makes so much sense. I'm going to shine my light in the Middle East. And then right now, between now and December, uh, the 15th, uh, the early morning 15th is Hanukkah uh, or Chanukah, the festival of light. Ain't that something? (laughs) The fact that I can even think about that and put that all together this early this morning or, or, you know, a couple hours ago or whatever, it it, it blows my mind. You know, and then I can bring it to you guys and upload it and to let you guys see it for yourself and be like, oh, wow. Yeah. Hanukkah does begin tonight, December 6th. And then it ends, uh, you know, uh, December 14th into December 15th. Wow. And it's the Festival of Light. Ain't that something? Ain't that something? And, you know, and we we know that the distraction is, is on right now. And, uh. And that God was going to shine his light inside of that distraction of evilness and war. And that's how, and when he revived that currency during that distraction, it would shock the world. Because the world has no clue why the Iraqi dinara would even be revaluing at this time. Because look what's going on with Turkey. Look, Turkey's invading Iraq without Iraq's permission. Russia planes are going down and Russia's bombing uh, uh, ISIS and Daesh and Syria. Then you got uh, France bombing. You got American troops everywhere. You got coalition troops. Germany sending 1,200 troops to Iraq. You got America sending troops to Iraq and Syria. You got all this stuff happening. And then then that currency is going to go. People are going to be, how in the world would you do that now? Because, see, (laughs) because that's how they're going to know it's the Lord. That's how they're going to know it's God. Because there, there ain't no other way you can explain turning on your currency right now. Only if God does it, and that's and that's what God wants, because He wants He wants all the recognition for this revaluation for the transfer of wealth for His people, and He's going to get it. And Lord, we we thank you, uh, uh, Abba Father Yahweh. We thank you, and Holy Spirit, Queen of Heaven, we, we the Ruach Hakadosh, Holy Spirit. We thank you as well, and we thank all the angels in heaven, and all our guardian angels, and the cherubim angels, and the mighty military angels that are in heaven as well. Uh, we just thank, man. We, I'm just so blessed to be in this situation and to be a leader of this uh, uh, historic event that is coming. But that was something I saw today, and I, and the Holy, I, I'm I'm pretty sure it was the Holy Spirit that gave me that discernment to figure that out. Hanukkah's the light festival of lights. God said he was going to shine his light on the distraction. <laughs> Currency 365. I'm powered by eyes open media. And I have my eyes open. I hope you do too, to be able to, 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 to discern things quickly. Cause you're going to need to be able to discern things and have common sense in these end times. All right. That's how we're going to stay alive in these end times and fulfill our destiny. We don't follow our dreams. Remember, we fulfill our destiny. Shalom.